everybody and how are you? Uh, my name is Iris Smith and um, I'm the owner of a small business called The Flower Patch. Um, right, today I decided, uh, because my bamboo rings arrived uh, yesterday, I decided that I'm going to do an arrangement with them today. Um, as you can see, I've got them hanging up here because I'm going to be working at nearly my eye view, just below. Um, I've uh, sprayed the, as you can see I've got black on me, I've sprayed the bamboo sticks, three of them black, um, I've put a, I've tie wrapped them together at the top and also at the bottom. Um, I was going to um, put a little screw through them but uh, I decided, um, oh let's just tie wrap them, <laughs> uh, it's easier. Uh, I got um, a small cylinder oasis uh, dry foam and covered it in the wreath wrap went around a few times and I've covered it on the top as well as underneath as well and I've also um, put a tire up over the top to hold it in place and also glued it to the bottom as well um, I just wanted to do something different that's all I used a black ribbon with a gold lavarts on to hopefully it will stay up there. <laughs> Fingers crossed. If not, because I can't find the other. Oh, I can. I can see it there. The other hook. Um, right. So what we're going to do is black and gold. I'm not going to fill the uh, the bamboo inside. I'm not going to fill it. Um, all up and make I'm just going to try and make it as minimal as possible or just to how I like it <laughs> sort of right so I've got out some of my uh, black ruscus I thought let's get some of that in um, with us doing black and gold and uh, that will have a lovely effect against everything we're doing Oh, first of all, I've done a bow. I haven't attached it yet because this bow, I want to hide my mechanics at the top. So I want to fit it at the top. I'm not, I'm, I've considered, um, I've got a piece here doing just a few, couple of tail ends at the bottom. I'm not sure yet, so I've left that out until nearer to the end because you may not see them. So yeah, I've done a bow where it's three inch loop, um, the black, plain black, and then I've done a gold metallic with polka dots in the center, and then my gold, uh, black and gold love heart ribbon. This is just silk, it's got no wiring, so I've slightly done the loops in the center smaller because I tried them at the th uh, three inch and they were just flopping over, so I've made them slightly smaller in the center. It was, you perhaps can see so that's the bow and um, I've got out or should, and I've done this as well I've sprayed three white roses and I've sprayed them black they still look a bit wet but I've touched them and they're not um, so it must be just how it's dried I'm not sure but I've uh, sprayed three in black um, I got out some feathers, uh, two different sorts. I've got out the one where it's got like a swirl pattern across the top, if you can see. I've got out, I think, three of those, and then I've got out five smaller ones with a gold tip. So that's what we've got there. I may not use all of them, but I've just got them out in case. I'm not sure if I'm going to use greenery, uh, but I've got a couple of about three bits out of greenery but I have got the conifer because I thought that may look nice against it as well uh, and I, um, I have got some cypress leaves which are very light and I have got some pine as well so that's the size that they come um, they're just little ones on stem small stems so I've got those out as well so I may just use one or all three I'm not sure as we go along. I've got out three pieces, because I can't make my mind up, 
of my black fern and I've also, oh my goodness, I've got out three pieces of my gold palm as well. So I'm not sure whether to mix them or just have one or the other. So I've got those out also. Um, I've got out, let me move those, um, two pieces, again, I may not use all of it, but of gold ficus with the metallic gold. So I thought they would give off a nice, nice shimmer against the blacks. So I've got those. Now I've got out some black baubles and one, well it looks tan to me, but it is gold. Um, I've got a big one, the glass one with the snowflake. I was considering hanging that there. I was thinking, you know, as well in case, or with just a little bit of tail ends. And then I can't make my mind up whether to have the glitter, that one, and a gold, or add in the matte and take one of these away instead. So again, I think that one looks better than the matte. So I've got those also. Um, I've got what we had the other day again. I may not even incorporate this. The smaller leaf palm. That's what it looks like to me. And I've also got two stems of these. I don't know what they're called, but I've got them in a jar, in, uh, vase in my living room. Um, and I'm not sure what they're called, but I think they are stunning. I love the way that they, they just, I don't know, open and bare and you can see straight through them. I like that. And then I've also got five pieces of uh, this. I think this looks quite oriental and I'm not sure what it's called, but I've got five pieces of those also. Um, I've got three, again, I may not use these because these are quite weighty. Um, three of my swirls that I've already put picks on and I may use those just to add a bit of decoration you know into the uh, arrangement and I've got one piece of um, gold hydrangea and he's fluffing up a bit um, that I'd like to sit perhaps in the centre somewhere and then I've got three small metallic like the same as the Farkas gold roses as well. So that is what we've got guys. So if I just watch the baubles again, oh gosh. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible with baubles. I don't like the way that they, they roll around. So first of all, I want to attach our bow. Um, I put, instead of a floral wire, I put another black tie wrap or zip tie through the bottom as well, so it holds in place. I've left a few, uh, a few of the tail ends long. I want to see if they're, whether they look better long, but I think I may end up cutting them looking at it. So all I wanted to do was go on the top. I hope you can see underneath and then just pull on the tie wrap. And just so it sits, if I can just have a look. And just maneuver some of the uh, loops before I actually pull tied. I wanted to just let some of these hang and see what it may be like. Let me just take it off guys because I can't see above. Too tiny. So that's... I want to get the tail ends hanging. Again, just so I can see what they look like. If they're too long, I will chop them shorter. Mm. 
Mm, it may be all right. So let me just pull on the tie wrap that I've placed underneath so it stays in place. And I've used black with this being black so it, it doesn't show as much. Oops, I get a bit sceptical about this because it's, let me bend it so it's in a little bit more if I can, oh I can't with that one, let me get the other one guys, so them ones are quite tough, this I made out of a piece of stem, so if I just close that a little bit, Close that. So then it should hang quite well. There we go. So that's the bow on the top. I hope you can see. Let me just put again quickly come and have a look. If I just slightly lift it a little bit more. There we go. I've had to zoom out, guys, because. Uh, I had it closer in and uh, you just couldn't see if I was going to hang anything at the bottom. So that's the, uh, the bow on. Let's have a look at some of our, our greenery. Again, I may just pull the odd one off instead of having them all as one. No, I think it's better with the three. So I'll glue that back on. And again, I'm going to cut the stems relatively short because we're only using the cylinder. So I'm just going to place and just bend so it's hanging. I hope you all had a good day yesterday. I went to the choir practice and we, we sang through all the songs that were singing. Oh my goodness, I came home uh, really uh, with a uh, deep voice. got to go tomorrow half past one and then um, to do a run through and once we've done the run through then we come back home and we have to be at the church for around seven o'clock tomorrow evening ready for the concert Place one there. I may place one there as well. I'm just bending these over. So 
So I've got something like that. <laughs> Excuse me. Right, um, where are they? Oh, it's here. So I've got that. Let's get that. Let's get some of our ruskus in as well, because I'd like the ruskus to also come out hanging over. Let's cut that as well. And I'm going up at a diagonal position so it hangs over. Not doing them all at the same height, some are going slightly higher. And then I'm going to have the odd one that's shorter. And I'm cutting the stems at a 45 degree angle so they go in much better. smaller one there. I've got we just cut that oh here's my cat it was in earlier um, but then my son who's day off from work took him out into the house Oh, and he's obviously back. Don't, don't. No, don't. Stay there. Oh, here we go, guys. No, stay there. Oh, my goodness. I'll, make, I'll put some more black in. I just want to take a couple of these, oh, put one of these in. I'd like this to sit something like that. And then just shorten it. And place that at the top. Just sticking up like that. I thought I had some more of those. Hmm. Never mind. I'll use these as, and I want to bring some out here also. <clears throat> so that's hanging like that. I love doing things in black and gold. I think it's a, a lovely effect. <clears throat> and then we'll place one more of those. Should I get more? Yeah. Let's look for the knife, the longer stem leaves. I think I'm going to have one. Let's have a look at the back of here. Yeah, place one at the back. Like that. 
So that's the look of it all the way around. Let me just lift that one up slightly. So it's at a different angle to all the others. So that's how it's looking like that. We put those aside. I don't want those. Oh, they're here, the others. I knew I'd got three out. Let's have a look. I may put the one actually under the bottom. Let's take those off. Place it like that. I think one over here, through there. Oh, mind you, that's a bit where that one is. Sorry, guys, wrong place. Pull it out, take the glue back off. Here. Yeah. So then you've got that effect. <clears throat> now I've got out my fern. I do want some black fern in it. I want a little piece with that and maybe one coming out here and one another in another position. So if I put this as a diagonal position alongside the gold the palm, and maybe have that sticking slightly out. that bring one maybe here this one down and make it smaller. I'm just pulling a few of the leaves off at the bottom. Let's have a look. Yeah, bring it round here. So we've got the black in as well. Uh, where's that? I wanted that in the centre, the hydrangea around here. Somewhere in there. Again, I don't want to reach the top. I'm trying to keep it as much down as possible centre to the bottom. If I need any more of these I'll, I'll go and grab some. So I wanted that like that. Doesn't that look lovely against the black? If I just lean it. So we've got that. The 
bubbles. Oh, I'm very uh, <laughs> weary of baubles. See, that looks pretty like that, I think. Just down there. So we'll place those together. Get those in. I see some glue strings, all ones attached to me. And then we'll place that one. underneath. That's slightly shorter. And we'll place that one so that looks then like that. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> Let me have a look at these. I don't want these too long. I may bring some under here actually. I think I need something black or something different there. Let me just have a look with these little pines. I could place one of those in the centre. Just in the centre of the baubles. I'm not working in any um, particular way. I'm just going along, you know, putting different things in at different stages. I might one minute, you know, be putting a bauble in and then change my mind and then put a bit of greenery in. I've not got any particular way that I'm positioning, uh, placing things, well, not placing things, uh, inserting the elements uh, today. I'm just going by eye and think and looking to see what we may need. I've got a feeling I need to bring a bauble around the back because if it's moving, I may bring the big one. I think the big one's too big. Oh, I don't touch it. So let me bring one of the baubles around the back. I may have to grab another one, guys. So. Let me just get my bauble bag. What is chock a block? And look for some another black or gold. So we'll put the big one back. And there's one straight away. So there's not many mixed colours in here, guys. I have to Fish around. There's a gold one. Oh, here. So, oh, I don't know one. With that one. I'll hold on to it a little minute. I can't find. I had to empty this 
on the floor the other day. I couldn't find what I was looking for. Oh my goodness. I should have done this to start with. find the one what I'm looking for. So I'll use these Mr. Gosh. Otherwise I'll be there ages. There's that many. Let's get a pick. Place it in there. It's not going in. Oh there we go. Well I'll pin it glue off. Do the same with this one. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to have three on the other side because then, otherwise, then that makes that part look like it's the front. And if it's hanging up, um, I can nearly cut one of those. It's not going to look balanced around as it moves or if it moves around. So this time we'll have one at the top. We'll go around here. And get it in. And there. And one there. And then I'll place another one of these through. So then I've got that at the back as well. It's not much higher, but just slightly. Where at the front I've got two at the top, one at the bottom. On this side I've got one at the top, two at the bottom. So I've just reversed it. Right, I wanted to get, here they are. Can't make my mind up about yeah, I need some of that in. So I'm going to place some in and around here. So put some singular on by themselves. a bigger one around here I guess yeah and, so, and go from under the bottom place one along the bottom as well to add a bit hanging there. Got the 
this little one and like, oh, I just broke that. Oh my goodness. So, roses. I want one at the front where the hydrangea is. I'm debating whether to get another hydrangea to put here. I think I will. Let me just grab one, guys. I may have it slightly higher or maybe lower. We'll have a look. I'll just cut it at the highest stem first. Why is it for some reason it's telling me it looks better higher? Yeah, it does higher. So we'll go in here. Just have it slightly higher. Right, our roses. I'd like one around here at the front or back, I don't know whichever side it is. So just near the baubles, I'm going to have to hold it underneath. So one there. One in the centre, maybe this side. Let's... Yeah, one there. Let's hold it. These baubles are just sitting at the back of the palm as well. So you've got that one there, then you've got those two at the back there, or around this side, should I say. Right, I've got our feathers. Now let's have a look. Hmm. One here, just sticking slightly out. I don't want things being too too far out. And I'll bring one out here at the bottom. Like that. Bring one under here where the baubles are on this side. And go underneath. 
I don't know where to hold it. And then bring one out there. And then I've got our five little ones with the gold tip. But I also want to just dot around. Oh, they could look pretty up there. Oh, guys, they could look pretty there. Where's that pack? What did I do with the pack? Oh, I hope I've not put it back. I think I have. It's another one. So I could sit those there. Is there leaving that just plain? Yeah. I should have got my glue gun again. I always forget my glue gun. It's a real bad habit of mine. I'm not used to using the uh, glue pan. And if I can, uh, I've got some black corsage tape. I could easily go over with the tape if I think it's showing too much glue. Next one, try and do them around the similar area on each one so they don't look odd. So, around there. Yeah, I may end up having to just go over. That one was a bit messy. Oh gosh, it's stuck to me. And just cut these all down. Oops, I've moved it.
so that is all of those little feathers on top. something there or maybe just sticking out of here yeah so we've got those there I've got a longer one I could place coming up here glue <laughs> everywhere on my fingers where the, but where they should be one there one there might be one I don't want to hide that rose so I may just So, yeah, we'll place those in a little bit of decor. Just sitting in there nicely. I've cut these down quite small. I don't want them popping too far out. need some greenery around the centre. So we've got our little bit of our decoration. So I've got our gold roses. Also, let's see where we can place those. One sat inside, one slightly higher. Where did I say that was going here? And then one down here. <coughs> Again, that's what it looks like at the moment. Now I've got 
I was looking at some other greenery. I don't want to put too much green in colour. Uh, La, 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 la. Oh no, I don't. So that's the reason I got these out. But I may perhaps get a bit of sort of like salal or that. Because they're round, I think they would have a nice texture. Let's just have a look. I cut one short. Again, and then put these sort of like nearer to the centre instead of sticking out. Obviously, I'd position it a bit better than that. And I think they would look quite pretty. Just sat inside and then add a few more of the black muscus on the inside also so i think we'll try that first let's take off some bigger leaves right these have got rubber on and i don't want the it about the, I don't want the rubber. So let's see if I can. Pull it off. Yeah. So. I'll just turn. Place that behind the black, <laughs> black rose. So it's sat inside <clears throat> instead of sticking right out. That one. I'm just removing the rubber with these pliers because that's what. Oops, I'll have to stick that back in. Because they'll take, they are wire cutters and they will, uh, cable cutters and they will remove the outer part of the cable. Where's that other one I placed in? Oops, that one's come off as well. I think I may have to glue these on before I put them in. I'm just trying to use a, a fill of foliage just to cover up the oasis parts. That's glued. I'm going to place that one there. Must have been the one what was loose. Nice 
just thinking about you, you see. Oh, aren't you so kind? Like the camera was uh, going, and he don't like to be on camera. And I just went, and he went, and he moved back, <laughs> and he says, "Oh, behind the camera." <laughs> he hates it. He hates it. So, I shouldn't have said. Should I? I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> I should have not said anything to cut him out. Oh. <laughs> so I'm going to place a couple of these also under here, just to have a bit of greenery sticking out from the bottom. Let's take a few out. Here, I always think about you. Oh, isn't that sweet? <laughs> Wait till I tell him now with that, he'll be on the camera with his voice. He'll ask me to skip it out. <laughs> he hates it. I think it's quite funny when I catch him out. <laughs> oh, guys. Oh, really? Oh, I, I'm oh, beating myself up now. I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> well, you would have got him on camera. You may have just seen his body. He's just coming from work, so you may have just seen like, a bit of him. <laughs> but I just shouldn't have said anything. Oh, naughty me. I put a couple in the centre. Just slightly sticking above the hydrangea on one of them. <laughs> I place one here actually. With the roses. Wait till I go inside. <laughs> I'll wind him up. <laughs> So let's add some small roscos that I add from some oddments. So let's get some of those in. I'm not going to add a tail end, I don't think, because you can't really see where the uh, tie wraps are. Oops, one's fell off. Goodness, let me take the glue off. <laughs> I know that when I go in and I wind him up, he'll just say to me, "Why weren't you speaking? I only, I know when you're on camera because you speak." It's like if you do video recorders, you know, home videos, if you have parties and that, or you make sure he's, he's not on it, he goes and hides. <laughs> he doesn't like it. <laughs> so, let's get one of these in the centre. <laughs> let's have a big to black. Oh, I'll get him next time. <laughs> Don't you worry about that, guys. <laughs> Let's have a look. We'll have a bit of black around here. This is a bit, quite a bit of gold. I can get it in.
keep saying I'm going to get my autistic son on it because he hides away as well. And if I say to him, come on, let's get you on camera. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, not me, not me, Mum. One there, let's put that there. I know what he'll say, I just know what he'll say. Why didn't you tell me? Said you used to nod your head and do something like that. Why didn't you do that? <laughs> I tried. <laughs> he always says that when, when the camera's not running and if I'm in here, oh I've thought about you, yeah, I've made you a cup of coffee. I think guys that's enough I think if I keep adding it's just going to make it bigger and bigger and I don't want it as again I wanted to keep it quite minimal I think I could do with just another leaf there maybe I added one of them so yeah um, I just wanted to keep that not so much as I would usually put in I mean, I think they're uh, 20, 25 centimetre rings, I think, if I can remember correctly. I think I need a gold here. Oh, I could use that. Just manipulate it slightly. Oh, one of my leaves have dropped off. Now I'll place that like that. Place it under. So I think, guys, that we're finished. Um, again, I didn't want to add in too much. And I was dying once the rings arrived, as I've said before. Oh, I have to, I have to give it a go straight away. I've done the rings before, uh, but I have used to put chain on them. Uh, but I didn't on this occasion. I wanted to place the ribbon and put a ribbon at the top. Because not everybody likes ribbons, you see, so uh, so I thought, well, well, you don't have to have a ribbon. You can just leave it bare, you know, and put something around. I think I'm going to just put some corsage tape, like I said, some black one, because that, I don't like to see the glue, the mechanics. So if I get it out... new roller so let's cut it open and I'm going to just cut pieces off so it blends in better than the brown that it's on I put brown on them last uh, when I had them as I first bought them because I had no black but since I've bought, I've purchased the black, I'm going to go over it and cover the glue that's slightly seeping out. And I'm just wrapping it around the bamboo as well as the um, feather until I can't see anymore. Because again, 
I don't like it to look messy as you can see let's have a look if you can see oh we put where there's one yeah there the glue is here and I just don't like it I don't like to see it so okay let's go around the six feathers so I've only used three hoops Again, I'm pulling, just pulling on the tape, just so the stickiness uh, activates and sticks to the rest of it without coming off. And that will make it look much neater as well. Once you've removed, uh, you put your tape on. Go here. It keeps wanting to go around this way. I don't like as I say half half a job done I like to do it complete it to the you know full so let's get that on and I'm going to where the end of the brown tape is and also to the end of where I can see any glue showing make it again look better Two. I'll straighten the bowl up after now I've squashed it. And plus this will also support the uh, feathers stem by holding it on with a bit of extra support instead of just the glue. as well as finish it off and make it look done professional. One more. our bow back up. Let me take it off of here while I fluff my bow.
so guys that's it completed properly let's just hang that back down where it should be Put that blue off So there we have it. We have our black roses, our gold roses, our gold hydrangeas, um, our gold leaf uh, palm, as well as uh, the black fern, our green conifer or cypress leaves. I forgot what they're called. I mentioned them the other, day, the other week and I've, I've already forgotten. Um, and our black ruscus as well. And also our baubles. And this, and I can't remember what that is, um, and our black feathers. So I think, let me just move that over there, out of the way of the feather. And our little, uh, ori I think they're or look oriental to me. And our gold metallic uh, ficus as well, um, and our squirt, our little swirls, and the ribbon. Um, I think that's quite pretty. Um, again, I wanted to do something like this, but I, I was, I've been waiting for the um, for the actual rings to arrive. It's always the same over here. Come Christmas time, it. The uh, delivery service is so busy, um, so you just have to basically be patient, really. So, and the bow again at the top, just hanging and giving a bit of decor, uh, you know, a bit of decoration at the top as well. And I've hung it with the bow with the gold love arts. So, um, I hope you like that. I think it's wonderful. Um, I'm going to bring the camera closer, but I'm also going to say my goodbyes now. <laughs> um, and I, again, I won't be here over the weekend, but I'll be back on Monday because I've got the choir concert as well tomorrow. We're practicing uh, a run up at half past one till about four o'clock, and then we've got to come back, uh, come home, get our choir. Uh, uniform on and then we have to make sure we're back at the choir uh, at the church for I think seven quarter past seven tomorrow evening so I can you know give us a chance to have us tea and everything when we come back and um, so yes it's gonna be a busy day for me tomorrow so again I won't be back until Monday but I hope you all enjoy your weekend and uh, if it's cold where you all are guys, raining, whatever, snowing or minus degrees, uh, please wrap up, stay safe and stay very warm. And please, if you've got no reason to go out, stay in. You know, you can always do your crafting inside. I do. <laughs> uh, so again, I hope you have a wonderful weekend. And please subscribe, share to your friends and family, you know, and like, and give us a little comment, um, you know, again, because it does really help me. And if um, you want to be notified, press the little bell, and it, you will get notifications every time I've done a video. So, again, guys, um, all the best, and thank you so, so much for constantly watching, and you're all just wonderful people. And I love you to bits, you know. Thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart. I am very, very honoured to have you as my subscribers and also uh, my family. So take care, everybody, and all the best. Bye-bye. And I'm going to bring the camera slightly closer. One moment. See if I can get it off because the cable.
I don't want to get my thumbs in the way, guys. Oh, that's it, my thumb's in the way as I speak. Uh, so yes, there's your ring with your bow on the top and your bamboo rings with the swirly bits, your black rose and gold rose and your, your swirls, if I can move it around, your hydrangeas and your baubles and uh, an oriental leaf, I'm not sure what it is, and your feathers your little feathers up there as well and if I just swirl it around I don't know if you get to get a proper look <laughs> so guys I hope you really enjoyed that I sure did I love doing things like this and uh, if you've uh, got any bamboo or, or rings or anything like that give it a go don't worry about um, screwing them in, you know, together. Just tie wrap them together like I did. You know, I could have screwed it, but I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> you know, and I'm being honest. So, uh, yeah, just tie wrap them together like I did. It still will hold. So, again, guys, all the best and have a wonderful weekend. Take care. Bye.